Welcome to the Emo Quartet Hunger Games with special guests of Ryan Seaman and Alan Weeks. In District 1 we have Bebo and Alan. In District 2 is Gerard and Bob. In District 3 there's Moiki and Pete. District 4 is Stumpy and Hot Topic 5 is Andy and Ryan. District 6 is other Ryan and Nicole. In District 7 is Joe and Cupcake Boy. In 8 we have Crank Fat Frank and Eva. District 9 is Spencer and John. District 10 is Lead Scener and Skeleton Clique. In 11 is Party Poison and Jim. And last but not least, in District 12 is Jish and Small Bean. As the tributes stand on their podiums, the horn sounds. Other Ryan and John fight for a bag. John gives up and retreats. Lead Scener snatches a pair of sa- In case you don't know this is what say are. Crank Fat Frank runs away from the cornucopia. Moiki grabs a backpack, not realizing it's empty. I just now realize that I didn't put Frank Hero in the emo games. Oops. Stumpy kills Joe with a hatchet. Andy grabs a backpack and retreats. Jim Smallbean, Party Poison, and Alan share everything they gathered before running. Pete runs away from the cornucopia. Skeleton Clique bashes Bob's head in with a mace. Ryan runs away from the cornucopia. Bebo runs away from the cornucopia. Jish also runs away. Hot Topic. Gerard and Spencer work together to get as many supplies as possible. Cupcake Boy runs away from the cornucopia. Nicole runs away too. Eva takes a spear from inside the cornucopia. Day 1. Cupcake Boy, Nicole, and Bebo get into a fight. Cupcake Boy triumphantly kills them both. Stumpy searches for firewood. Spencer tries to spear fish with a trident. Skeleton Clique thinks about home. Small Bean and Eva track down and kill Moiki. Andy goes hunting. Gerard discovers a river. John tries to spear a fish with a trident. Jish strangles Ryan after engaging in a fist fight. Other Ryan steals from Crank Fat Frank while he isn't looking. Dallin, Lead Cena, and Pete hunt for other tributes. Jim and Party Poison work together for the day. Hot Topic dies trying to escape the arena. Night 1. Pete shoots an arrow through John's head. Stumpy receives fresh food from an unknown sponsor. Dallin begs for Party Poison to kill him. She refuses keeping Dallin alive. The person status thing glitched when the person died so just ignore the messed up photos. Anyway, Bebo, Bob, Moiki, Hot Topic, Ryan, Nicole, and John are all dead. Day 2. Small Bean discovers a cave. Andy receives fresh food from an unknown sponsor. Cupcake Boy questions her sanity. Pete diverts Crank Fat Frank's attention and runs away. Gerard thinks about home. Dallin attacks Spencer but manages to escape. Jim, Skeleton Clique, Jim, and Stumpy raid Eva's camp while she's hunting. Party Poison runs away from Lead Cena. Other right and somehow camouflages himself in the bushes while having bright blue hair and doesn't get found. Arena event. A cloud of poisonous smoke starts to fill the arena. Pete and Jim agree to die in the cloud together but Pete pushes Jim in without warning. Cupcake Boy and Eva decide to run into the cloud together. Dallin survives. Other Ryan slowly pushes Party Poison closer into the cloud until she can't resist anymore. Stumpy, Small Bean, Jish, and Gerard survive. Crank Fat Frank and Spencer agree to die together but Crank Fat Frank pushes Spencer in without warning. Glad we all get along here. Skeleton Clique is engulfed in the cloud of poisonous smoke. Lead Cena survives. Lead Cena and Gerard huddle for warmth. Stumpy climbs a tree to rest. I find this very funny cuz Stumpy climbs a tree. Get it cuz like tree stump. Okay sorry I'll stop now. Crank that Frank is awoken by nightmares. Pete destroys Jish's supplies while he's asleep. Small Bean, other Ryan and Dallin sleep in shifts. And he is awoken by nightmares. Pause the video and comment who you think will win the Emo Quartet Hunger Games. Or don't. I don't really care. Anyway. Day 3. Dallin collects fruit from a tree. And he sees smoke rising in the distance. But doesn't investigate. Jish defeats Small Bean in a fight. But spares her life. You're out of the band, Josh! Other Ryan explores the arena. Stumpy overhears Crank Fat Frank and Lead Cena talking in the distance. Gerard receives medical supplies from an unknown sponsor. Pete receives fresh food from an unknown sponsor. Night 3. Gerard is awoken by nightmares of someone taking his jackets away. 
Pete cooks her food before putting her fire out. Andy passes out from exhaustion. Nice. Stumpy tends to Jish's wounds. Crank Fat Frank. Lead Cena and other Ryan discuss the games and what might happen in the morning. Dallin and Small Bean tell stories about themselves to each other. Day 4. Small Bean sprains her ankle while running away from Jish. Gerard picks flowers. Bro there are people around you trying to kill you and are picking flowers. Andy poisons Pete's drink. She drinks it and dies. Other Ryan hunts for other tributes. Lead Cena is pricked by thorns while picking berries. Stumpy receives clean water from an unknown sponsor. Crank that Frank discovers a cave. Now be Bo Bob, Moiki, Hot Topic, Ryan, Nicole, Joe, Cupcake Boy, Eva, Spencer, John, Skeleton Clique, Party Poison, Jim and Pete are all dead. Night 4. Lead Cena strangles Small Bean after engaging in a fist fight. Dang I guess he really didn't like Tyler. Dallin loses sight of where he is. Stumpy receives medical supplies from an unknown sponsor. Crank Fat Frank decapitates other Ryan with a sword. Holy crap. Andy thinks about home. Gerard climbs a tree to rest. Josh thinks about home. Day 5. Jish steals from Crank Fat Frank when he isn't looking. Lead Cena attacks Stumpy, but he manages to escape. The feast. The cornucopia is replenished with food, supplies, weapons, and memoirs from the Tribute's families. Crank Fat Frank steals Jish's memoirs. Seems pretty accurate to me. Lead Cena sets an explosive off, killing Gerard, Andy, and Dallin. Stumpy doesn't go to the feast. Okay like everyone's dead except for Stumpy, Crank Fat Frank, Lead Cena, and Jish. Night 5. Jish convinces Crank Fat Frank to snuggle with him. Lead Cena destroys Stumpy's supplies while he's asleep. Day 6. Jish runs away from Stumpy. Lead Cena diverts Crank Fat Frank's attention and runs away. Night 6. Josh looks at the night sky. Crank Fat Frank, Stumpy, and Lead Cena get into a fight. Lead Cena triumphantly kills them both. Day 7. Lead Cena ambushes Jish and kills him. Ro. The winner of the Emo Quartet Hunger Games is Lead Cena. I guess haters really do win. Okay that's the end of the Emo Quartet Hunger Games. If you want me to make another one tell me in the comments and I'll do one with other band members. It took me a while to make this video so I really do hope you enjoyed it. If you did you should like the video so you can make me happy. Alright that's all I have to say. Till next time.